Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Y'all ready, y'all? Uh, 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 uh. Hold on. It's your boy Terrence Carter. And I am here, yo. Look at that smile, y'all. Back at it again with another video for y'all. So, your boy is seven days, man. Seven days clean, no smoking the marijuana. And I ain't going front, bro. I feel great. I'm going to keep it all the way thorough and real with y'all in today's video. I really do feel good, bro. Real talk. I know I just said great, but you get the point. Now, I want to make this video for y'all, for anybody out there that may be feeling as if, like, what's going to happen if I stop smoking weed or, you know, how would I be able to handle it, X, Y, and Z. Man, I'm here to tell y'all, bro, you're going to be perfectly fine, all right? Our vessels in this human experience learn how to adapt, and our vessels are truly, truly powerful, okay? I do want to say thank you to everybody that's been rocking out with me, anybody that's been watching these videos. If you are new to the channel and you want to help me grow the YouTube channel, you can. Just smash that subscribe button. Give the video a thumbs up so that we get these videos on the algorithm and leave your comments below. Shout out to everybody in the SR community, no fat community. And everybody that's been owning some stocks, bro. I keep telling y'all. I keep telling y'all, bro. Buy some stocks. It's either you, you do it or you don't. That's up to you. But seven days in, man. I honestly feel great. I have no cravings. Um, I feel better being sober-minded. You know, I have a lot more energy. Um, my mind is just super clear, bro. Like, my body feels super potent. On top of me being on semen retention, bro, like, it's just a, it's a great feeling, all right? And I know, like, when you are, you know, like, smoking, you honestly be feeling like, bro, like, when am I going to stop or how long am I going to keep doing this? Because I, the number one thing I want to try to realize, bro, is that you're spending a lot of money. Let's just keep it all the way real, bro. I don't care. You're spending a lot of money on a substance that ain't going to bring you no money back in return. I'm going to keep it 1000 with y'all, bro. And the reason why I say, like, bro, like, I'm, I'm really proud of myself is because I took the initiative to stop. You know? I took the initiative to just go cold turkey and say, like, nah, bro, I don't want to do it no more because I see the bigger picture for myself, bro. Like, especially if I'm going to be, first of all, bro, especially if I'm going to be in the stock market, investing my money, I remind myself, bro, like, this money can be used to make you more money, T. And that's just the facts, all right? So I definitely want to share with y'all on the channel how I feel today compared to day one. Now, day one was the toughest, the toughest, bro, both on a mental level and physically. I'm not going to front to y'all. All right, and um, today compared to day one, I feel ten times better. Uh, uh, the vivid dreams are very, very real. My energy levels continue to get higher. Once again, I have a lot of mental clarity, um, creative energy, creative juices. This is why I continue to make these videos for y'all. And just overall, bro, like another thing too, I've been thanking God. Real talk, bro. Like, I've really been thanking God. Like, just just thank you for allowing me to see this version of myself again. Let's just keep it real, bro. When you are... And it's nothing against people that smoke weed. I'm not about to be one of the people that's like, Oh, look at you. You smoke weed. No. Chill out. I'm not about to be one of those people, bro. There's nothing against anybody that does that. But you got to keep it real with yourself, bro. You, you, you do want to have moments in your life where you are sober-minded. Let's just keep it real, bro. You, you do want to have those moments where you're like, I don't, I don't need that. I'd rather just rock out with my own pure energy, you know? And just, like, looking back, bro, like, I would, t like, I would, I would see, like, bro, when people say, oh, I'm afraid that I'm not going to be able to, like, 
like the food is not going to taste the same and the music is not going to sound the same and whatever, bro. Like, I'm not going to handle creativity. All of that is a lie, bro. Like, you're just being stuck in your head, okay? You have to learn how to just, like, take back your power and, like, not allow something outside of yourself to have control over you, all right? Real talk, bro. Like, for those out there, you 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 might enjoy drinking alcohol. You you may enjoy smoking cigarettes. You you may enjoy PMO videos. Just just cut that out. Cut all of that out. Because our natural state of mind is being sober. You know? Your natural state is retaining your seed. Let's, let's just keep it a thousand. Alright? Um I'm extremely proud of myself because when I was on day one, I'm like, bruh, like, goodness gracious. I was having headaches. I was I was a little bit, you know, agitated and, you know, whatever. But, you know, in day two as well, day three. But as the days continue to progress, you actually start looking forward to each day on this journey, just being sober-minded. You know what I'm saying? Like, and it just overall feels very, very good, you know? Like I said, the cravings went away. Um, I ripped up anything that I had that was weed related, all papers, threw away the grabber. Definitely don't have no weed, no none of that. And I've been proud of myself too because I've been saving more money. I'm gonna tell ya, just in a week alone, because this is day seven. So just in a week alone, I've saved over like a hundred and fifty dollars. In just a week. And the reason why I'm proud of that is because that money is in the stock market. You understand what I'm saying? Like, it's not to the weed person. You feel me? It's not like being just wasted. It's actually, it came back to me. You know? And I honestly feel too like God is proud of me because God is like, about time, my boy. Like, finally. Finally. You feel me? And I, I also did this for myself, too, because I, I told myself, like, I do not want anything to have in the, like, a hold on me, right? I don't want anything to feel like it has control over me. Like, I can't I can't put down the, the weed or I can't stop watching the PMO. Like, you never want to feel that way to where you feel like this has more control over you than you do over yourself, you know? So everybody has, like, their own personal reasons as to why they stop doing certain things. And if you're a person, whether you're a man or a woman out there, and you're feeling like, I'm afraid to stop smoking, stop being fearful. Fear is what gets in the way of your success. You're, you're afraid of how you're going to feel. You're afraid to face your own feelings. You're afraid to face reality, sober-minded. But there's nothing to fear, bruh. Regardless, even, bro, let's just, let's just keep it a thousand. Let's just say you're going through something in the outside world, right? And you smoke. Cool. Whatever you're going through is still going to be there. You feel me? So for myself, I reminded myself, like, bro, like, I'd rather just tackle whatever I'm going through. Sober-minded. Tackle it head on. Tackle it head on. Feel my feelings. Don't run away from them. Don't suppress them. Don't think that, oh, I'm going to smoke this blunt and that's going to make the things go away. It's not. All right? Got to get out of your head. You understand what I'm saying? Um, food still tastes way, it tastes the same, it tastes better, right, music, still fire, still amazing, you know what I'm saying, like, workouts, still great, you know, it's just like, the excuses that, that you're using are just in your head, you gotta let go to grow, you know, and, once again, ask yourself, how much money can you save and put towards assets that can Bring you more income over time. That, that should be the bigger picture. Breaking all, all vices. Breaking all addictions. So that you can get back to your natural state. Right? And then on top of that, like I said, I'm on retention. So my retention benefits have been amplified. Right? Like, I feel like the universe has been rewarding me even more. Real talk. And the universe is like, let's go. T, this is what I'm talking about. Put all that energy into your crowd. Put all that energy into your YouTube channel. Put all that energy into adding value to people. Put it back into yourself. You know what I'm saying? So it's just it's just an overall like I feel great. Um and 
I want to just continue to share these messages with y'all, bro. Like, anything is possible if you just set your mind to it, bro. Your mind has to be stronger than your emotions, okay? Once again, your mind has to be stronger than your emotions, all right? If I could do it, y'all could do it, too. Y'all seen me. Day one, day two, I'm sitting there telling y'all I'm agitated. My head is hurting. X, Y, and Z. I'm just I'm letting y'all know how I was feeling. And now here I am a week in, and I'm like, bro, first of all, that was fast. And second of all, it's like, bro, I just feel 10 times better, bro. You know? And it's not, bro, I'm going to tell you this too. You're going to have some people out there that's like, oh, it's, it's the person. It's not the weed, which is, it's, in some way, shape, or form, that is true. Like, some people are just naturally lazy, bro. Like, that's just people. You feel me? So we don't want to be blaming things on 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 anything. You're just holding yourself accountable. You know? Like I said, this is just for myself as a personal choice. I'm like, bro, I could be putting that money elsewhere. I could be using my energy, the same energy I'm going to go and buy some weed and X, Y, and Z. I could be putting that energy, YouTube, more Uber Eats, you know, stock market. Owning more real estate in the stock market. Buying more Amazon stock. Buying more Apple stock. You know, like, stuff like that, bro. So, it's just an internal journey. It's a it's a, uh, a change that I had to make within myself internally. And I'm just naturally just, like, truly proud of myself. Real talk. All right? So, anybody out there, y'all can do it, too. You can do anything you set your mind to. You know, don't let nobody doubt you. Don't uh, doubt yourself, most importantly. And um, learn how to believe in yourself and trust yourself. Word. All right? Take the journey one day at a time. Don't let fear get in the way because fear is an illusion. Force evidence appearing real. Okay? And take back your power. Real talk. So, I'm about to go get this workout in. Enjoy my Friday today. Happy Friday to everybody watching today's video. Once again, if you are new to my YouTube channel and you would like to help me grow the channel, all you got to do is hit that subscribe button. Give today's video a thumbs up. Give my other videos a thumbs up so that we get these videos on the algorithm. Leave your comments below. Let me know what you guys think about today's video. And also, too, if you want to join my free Discord, it will be in the description below. And if you guys want to check out my ebooks, yeah, I definitely can. I'm going to be cooking up some more ebooks, but I'm going to be creating some more for the channel for those out there in the human experience that need the help. Whether it's about no fab, retention, the stock market, whatever. Right? So, just wanted to create this video right quick for y'all. I appreciate y'all. I love y'all. Real talk. Thank y'all for rocking out with me. And um, let's keep up the momentum. All right? It's your boy, Terrence Carter. Like, comment, and subscribe. Yes, sir.